and we're back. We're here with the Ninja. It's another beautiful day. It's like 80 degrees out. It is tank top weather. Um, but we're back. We got new mirrors. Um, to get rid of these ugly ones. Now these are super functional, they're gray, they do what they're supposed to do. I just don't like the way they look. Um, so we're gonna get rid of them. They remind me of the ears from that one movie, How to Train Your Dragon. Um, they just stay too much. A lot of the times when I take photos and I see other people do the same thing, they actually fold the mirrors in so they don't stick out as much. But we're gonna get rid of it. Um, so we got, it just came in the mail. We're gonna unbox this together. These were $27. They had solid ratings. Shh, uh, 27 bucks. They had solid ratings. Let's take these keys out of my pocket. Hmm. Let's try white one hand this time. Oh, yeah. Hold on. Right. Right. Okay. Hold on. I'm on to something. I'm on to something. Hold on. Hold on. I was prepared for these people. Okay, hold on. Check. Quick test. Ooh. The box says rear mirror on it. Interesting. Um, as you can see from the photo, the bladed mirror. This is nice. Nice packaging so far. Let's move back here so the wind doesn't blow it away. Got a rubber gasket. Some tools. Nice. Ooh, I thought these were gonna be plastic. They're not plastic. Woo. These are nice. They have some weight to them. They're not plastic. They're metal. I thought they were plastic. This is way better. So this will hold it better. It's just a smudge. It's just a smudge. Look at that. And then they swivel, they turn. And there's little stoppers, they don't turn too much. But this is nice. So, I'm gonna take all this. It should be a, a self-explanatory install. Come over here. I might also change the windscreen for a smoked one. Not 100% sure yet. Basically, Allen wrench. Oh no, oh no. Okay, the Allen wrench they provided does not fit these, so let me go find one that does fit these. I'll be back. We'll be back in a GP. Okay, we're back. So good news and bad news. The good news is I got them. I got. I can get them off. The bad news is this is how I'm getting them off. I left my toolbox in the Jeep, which is not with me. So um, this is a five thirty seconds Allen head key thingy like that. It works. Take like the two black bolts off. They're about an inch long bolts. Um, yeah, this is actually also how you take off the, the windshield, which should come off super easily. But that's how she's off. Now, the original mirrors don't come with a gasket on them. These black ones do. And also, these black ones come with... Um, these middle things. I don't know what these middle things are for. But, we're going to use the bolt I have. I'm going to reuse these. So, we'll grab one of these. We'll grab this. That goes on it like that. And then, okay. Okay, I'm gonna put this together. Hold on. And we're back. These are nice. So they install the same way you take them off. Put the rubber gasket under. They adjust forward and backward like an infinite amount. There's no clips. It's just steady. Which is super nice. And they don't seem like they're gonna move. Or kind of you gotta give it like a lot of pressure to move it. And then. Back, this is even harder like to move it so you you can find adjust it without ever having to worry about it actually kicking back like on a windy day or like if you're driving high speed these are nice 
pobre. Look at that. So you can hide them when you want. Get this out of my hand. much better look at that wow okay I'm gonna install the other one and finish off with this and just like that we are done so in the normal way they're supposed to be sitting bladed like that super nice super sleek sitting on the bike you don't see them, which is pretty nice. That's so much better. And then when you need them, again, there's a lot of resistance. I saw some guy complain that they just move on their own. I don't, not here. Just hold them out like this. And they're out. And you can adjust them like back and forth. Like that. Again, an infinite amount. It's not like they're clicking or anything. It's just a smooth transition. I'm gonna have to go riding to see more, but to see where I want them. But look at that. That's so much better. So much better. Even when they're out, they're way like, they don't stick out anymore. They're not hideous like the old ones. Just let's take this old one and put it up right next to where it used to be. Look at that, just the head, the actual mirror section of this is bigger than the entire mirror. Look at that, way nicer. Install was easy, I did use the black bolts they came with. They don't move, they don't jiggle. That's nice. So we'll wrap up this video. Um, I'm probably gonna end up ordering a smoked uh, windshield now, honestly. Um, but yeah, why do these fairings look like they're popping out? But yeah, we're all done, guys. I've wanted to do this for a while. The next thing is with the exhaust. We're going to get rid of the exhaust. Um, this muffler needs to go. But yeah, thanks for, uh, thanks for tuning in, guys. So we're back with the bike. I'm actually heading to work right now, but I wanted to do a quick update video. Um, so I rode the bike for like... 25 miles today back and forth to the gym and stuff with the mirrors um i understand why they mount the mirrors up here now no matter how much i adjust it um i can it'll if i adjust it one way it'll either show not the lane next to me if i'm on the highway for example not the lane next to me but like five feet more so the third lane if i'm on the right lane i can see all the way to the left lane but i can't see nobody next to me if that makes sense and if i adjust it to where i can see behind me the my hands and my grips are right here or my hands in the bar so i can't see so usability if the old mirrors were like say example set so the bar old mirrors were 10 out of 10 these are about a 1 out of 10 they're damn near useless as mirrors but they look great aesthetically 10 out of 10 functionally they're garbage but that's not the mirrors i mean that's not like this amazon branded mirror itself that is just the style you could go try bar and mirrors. I don't want to try bar and mirrors. Um, I'm not going to put the old mirrors back on. I think these look great. I'm just going to turn my head more. But yeah, usability wise, don't expect to get these and think that they're going to be as usable as the old mirrors. They're not. They're far from it. But they're there. You have mirrors. And they look great. So yeah, just a quick update. I'm actually heading to work. I thought I'd just close off the video before I actually put it all together. I thought I'd swing by and just give you guys a quick update on it um but yeah thanks for tuning in time for work